Hi, welcome to Spire Manufacturing. My name is Mark Pedovic and I'm the manufacturing engineer here. Uh, here at Spire we have a unique situation. We have to balance our workload between our NASCAR programs and our outside customers. At Spire Manufacturing, our current capabilities are 5-axis, 3-axis mills, and lathes with live tooling. Behind me is our Haas uh, VF6. It's a 3-axis mill, and we are running some simple mild steel plates. We have OP1 on the left-hand side, OP2 on the right-hand side. OP1 is being held down by some uh, pit bull clamps, and OP2 is being held down by some bolt features that we produce during OP1. At Spire Manufacturing, we machine quite a bit different materials. They range from stainless steel, your 304Ls, to your 174 pHs, uh, from your, your peak to aluminum. So we, we try to run the gamut. And today we got a, a stainless steel ring that we're doing for an outside customer. It's a, a fairly large order. It's uh, a little bit over 100 pieces. Uh, we try to stay between the five piece range to five pieces to a couple of hundred even though I'm going to contradict myself when I talk about the VF6. On this 304 stainless steel part we have here, it's pretty neat. We have, uh, starts out as a nine inch long blank. We'll come in, set our work offset, run a piece, and we actually have a macro that comes in. And every time it cuts a part off, it will invert the part distance and keep on running continuously and drop the part off in the parts catcher. So uh, you start with a nine inch long blank and it'll just run by itself. One of our latest additions to Spire Manufacturing is our Haas 5-axis mill. We bought it to bring more parts in-house. Our biggest project for it was our Centrelink right here. Before we had our 5-axis mill, this part would take at least five operations to complete. Now with the help of the 5-axis machine, we got it down to two operations. It's still about a four to five hour project, but it utilizes one machine rather than two. Some of the key benefits of a five axis, as you may know, is hitting the part from all four sides. Take this fire bracket, fire bottle bracket, for instance. This was traditionally a, at least a three op part, if not more. We were able to take this part and run it into one op. I utilize some tabs on the bottom side and we were able to pop it out, pop it out of the machine. That saved on our cycle time and our setup time, thus creating a less inexpensive part. Here on the table, we have a small sample of uh, internal and external parts that we do. A lot of these parts are ran on the five axis machine and allowed us to go from a three or a four part operation to a one or a two part at the two part operation at the most like this fire bottle bracket, for instance. This was done traditionally in at least four operations. We were able to tab this part on the bottom end and it brought it down from four ops to one op, thus saving on setup time and reducing the part cost. Being such a small growing shop, everyone here shares many responsibilities. Everyone has to get their hands involved with the design, the programming, manufacturing, inspection, and even shipping the parts. Thank you everybody for watching and a special thank you to Practical Machinists for allowing us to give you a shop tour. To find out more, head on over to spire-motorsports.com.